it happens of its own accord in some sense, like you can participate in it, I guess, and you can interfere with it, and it seems to take a certain amount of willpower, but it still all happens mysteriously behind the scenes. One of the things that I've been so, so, you know, there's lots of different ways to interpret the world, and you can maybe even make a case that there's an endless number of ways to interpret the world. And the problem with that is that it kind of disorients you in terms of what you should be doing. But just because there's a very large number of ways to interpret the world doesn't mean there's a very large number of pro productive, meaningful, and sustainable ways to interpret the world. And one of the things you do have to do is figure out how you can conduct yourself today so that you don't upset the apple cart in a week or a month or a year. And so, you know, what, what you do in some sense psychologically is you admit to yourself that your current frame of reference is faulty. Mm -hmm. And then you start opening the door to a different kind of thinking, which is more creative thinking. It's more lateral thinking. Saying, well, I'm wrong, but that's not necessarily a problem because I could be right if I thought some other way. Well, you know, that's great. Often it works. Yeah. And it, there's, there's almost no lack. There's almost no end to the utility of trying to figure out which ways that you're wrong. Because yeah. there's lots of them. And every time you discover one, then you don't have to be quite so wrong anymore. That's a really good deal. Yeah. What's your time worth? You're a university student. Well, it's certainly worth minimum wage, because obviously. But it's worth way more than that, because if you spend a productive hour when you're 20, then you gain the benefits of that hour for the rest of your life. So there's the compounding effect of time spent when we were young. So I say, well, let's assume your time's worth 50 bucks an hour, which I think is an underestimate, but whatever. 